Hey guys, welcome back to my video where we're going to talk about DNS leaks. I'll show you how to find out if you have one and how to protect you from it using a VPN. So what is DNS? A DNS is a domain name system. It's like a phone book for the internet covering website names into IP addresses so your device can't connect to them. However, sometimes your DNS requests may be intercepted or leaked, putting your privacy at risk. But don't worry, because I'm going to show you how to protect yourself using a VPN. Now, before we begin, if you'd like to try any of the VPNs mentioned in this video, you'll find the latest pricing, discounts, and reviews available in the description down below. First, you need to check your IP address. Now, there are many websites that can help you do so, but we recommend using whatismyip.com. Then go to the website and it will display your current IP address. Now that you have your IP address, it's time to check your DNS. For this demonstration, I'll be using ExpressVPN and it has a free tool called DNS Leak Test. First, go to the website and click on the standard test button. The tool will then start checking your DNS servers. Once the test is complete, the tool will display a list of DNS servers and their locations. And so if you see any DNS servers that are not from your internet service provider ISP, then you have a DNS leak. This means that your DNS requests are being sent to servers that are not trusted and your privacy may be compromised. Now, if you do have a DNS leak, don't worry, it's relatively easy to fix. First, contact your ISP and ask them to provide you with secure DNS servers. Also, you can use a VPN service that provides you with its own DNS servers. Now, if you're not sure what a VPN or virtual private network is, it is a service that allows you to connect to the internet through a private network, stream safely, keeping your online activities and private and secure at all times. And so when you use a VPN, your online traffic is encrypted and routed through a remote server, making it difficult for anyone to intercept or monitor your internet activity. And so I've been regularly testing the best and most popular VPNs and have narrowed it down to Express, Nord, and Surfshark as the best three VPNs overall. Of course, they all vary in budgets and features, yet they all have a kill switch. They're excellent for torrenting, and they all consistently work with streaming services such as Netflix, Hulu, and Amazon Prime Video. And that's why these are my favorite three. But depending on your situation and preferences, one of them may be a better choice for you. And I'll explain why. Now, starting with ExpressVPN, and this is going to be the one to get if you're looking for the best overall, fastest, and easiest to use VPN. And it has the most verified no logs policy which was demonstrated through a real-life stress test proving that they don't collect or track any user data. It has over 3,000 servers in 94 countries, which is a big number of countries allowing you to easily access content from all over the globe. Plus, you can secure up to five simultaneous connections per account, and it's compatible with most devices. And so ultimately, whenever people ask us what the best, most reliable VPN is, and don't mind spending a few extra dollars to ensure the highest level of reliability, Express is our trusty go-to choice for those looking for a premium VPN. Next up is NordVPN, and Nord is what I consider the best value of VPN. It has over 5,400 servers in 60 countries, and while more servers does not necessarily mean better service, this can help with speed and latency, especially if you use a VPN for gaming, or if you want extra features such as a threat protection which blocks ads, malware within websites, as well as protect your device from harmful files, which is a neat little feature. And so Nord kind of gives you more options to fiddle with, and that's where the value for the money comes from, especially that it's about as fast as ExpressVPN in terms of performance, and will let you secure up to six devices per subscription, as opposed to ExpressVPN's five device limit. So all in all, if you're someone looking to have a few more options in your VPN, then Nord would be the one to get. And then finally, Surfshark is our pick for the best budget VPN. And while it has all the essentials like Express and Nord, it's not quite as fast as those two. Although with Surfshark, you're allowed to virtually secure an unlimited number of devices with just one account, so it's a great option if you don't want any simultaneous connection limits. You also get over 3,200 servers in 100 countries, which is a lot. You still get some bonus features such as an ad blocker for blocking pop-ups, two types of specialty servers, as well as no borders mode, 
and rotating IP, which can be very useful if you're looking to use your VPN in a restrictive country. So ultimately, if you're looking to spend the least amount of money, but still have all the core features of a premium VPN, or if you need a VPN that allows you to secure all of your devices, or if you have a large family, then Surfshark is the ideal choice. And so to sum it up, these are definitely the best in the business. Express is a premium VPN with a strong emphasis on security and utmost anonymity. And it's perfect for those who are privacy conscious and are looking for the best VPN overall. Then NordVPN is a well-rounded high-performance VPN that offers a lot of value for the money and is ideal for those looking for bonus features that can be useful in a variety of ways besides base VPN functions such as a strong encryption, secure torrenting, and working with streaming services. And Surfshark is truly the best budget VPN that gets the job done without sacrificing any of the necessary security features that you usually get with more expensive VPNs. And as an added bonus, you get to share it around with as many of your friends and family as you like, which is a great plus. So that's it for this video. Again, if you're interested in these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing and discounts as well as in-depth reviews in the description down below. And feel free to comment below if you have any questions, as I love getting to interact with you guys. Like and subscribe if you found this video to be helpful or would like to stay up to date with future videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.